We're going to do the lecture, the province of Manitoba. Facts about Manitoba. In 2014, Manitoba was fifth top destination for new permanent residents after Ontario, Quebec, Alberta, and British Columbia. Manitoba worked on the highest number of refugees per capita in Canada in 2014. Manitoba received the second highest number of provincial nominees and family class immigrations on record. Manitoba received more than 5,000 temporary workers. The top occupations are registered nurse, secondary school teachers, industrial butchers, and cooks. The job market in Manitoba. The job market in Manitoba are focused on the following industry, agriculture and agribusiness, manufacturing, transportation and logistics, aerospace, electricity and environmental industries, information and communication technologies, ICT and digital media, financial services, mining, minerals and petroleum, and building products. Manitoba main cities. Here we can see the main cities in Manitoba with the population and the changes in population and their density. Winnipeg is the biggest city and the capital city of the province. But other cities to mention are Brandon, Dauphin, Flin Flam, Morden, Steinbach, Townsend, etc. And now, let's take a look at the recommended online resources for the province of Manitoba. And here we are in the website of the province of Manitoba. We can see this page this is working in Manitoba. We give you the information about living in Manitoba, moving to Manitoba. A guide for Winnipeg for indigenous Manitobans, since the population of the settlers indigenous population in Manitoba, and also other employment opportunities. So you get started here. You can search for jobs. You can check recruitment opportunities. Working for government if you are living in Canada. Information for job seekers. And you can join the website of Manitoba through Facebook or follow on Twitter. Or subscribe to the RSS so you can check information. You can also check their videos in YouTube and photos on Flick. Okay, so interesting website. Another one from the same website is the career development section, and here you can have the career development with the job search choices, Manitoba side, find my job, also several job banks that work with Manitoba government size if you want to get information about jobs in the government if you're living already in Canada federal size also and the Manitoba sector council for industry and associations so you can use this also depending on the type newcomer you you can click as a job seeker or newcomer and then you're gonna have a different information about languages recognition career uh, suggestions, finding employment in Manitoba, or starting a business or farm, okay? As a job seeker, you can find here how to navigate the career path transitions. You can learn about the job search strategy that they recommend, job banks, resume, writing and combo letters, and interview skills. So, all the information that you might need for getting a job in Manitoba. If I go for the job banks, just tell me exactly where we were checking before. So just take a look at this page in the Manitoba government website. Another interesting tool that you can find is the cost of living in Winnipeg. So in this side, you can compare cost of living. If I go to the cost of living section for Winnipeg, 
you tell me in US dollars how it's gonna be you can change that to other currency but US dollars and then you can compare the rent of housing or an apartment have an idea of a premium normal or lower so the premium will be 1500 the normal will be around 800 and the lower will be 500 Airbnb you have some choices a studio apartment co-working in space you have the utility for internet electricity mobile again others the one in series because it's gonna depend on the service that you get the average cost of coffee pizza KFC McDonald's sandwiches etc so you have an idea of the prices in Manitoba and the prices of these items so you have a an educated guess when it comes to the cost of living in this province so this is for Winnipeg you can change here for the different cities in Canada Winnipeg but it's a good tool to use and finally we have of course the list of the best employers in Manitoba and here this is the list of the 2019 winners here are the list of the companies Take a look at it and if you find one that is in your industry or you're interested in, just pick one and try to get some information from them. If not, you can search the job bank and find better opportunity with willing employers. I hope you enjoyed this section. Uh, just consider Manitoba as one of your choices when it comes to Canada. Uh, we'll see you the next one. Thank you very much.